Hello guys, my name is Nightwalker Lots, and I want to show you two methods of how to use modded uh, game saves for the Xbox 360. And this is for the Xbox 360 only. So, to get started, let's say that um, you download a... Uh, you download a game save from some some random website off the or off the browser, and you get a uh, a file. Um, I'll show you right now. Uh, no. Fuck. Kind of like this, and you get like a, just a random save file, and in that modded save file is going to be just this file where it's just a, a modded save. Um, I want to show you how to use that. So method one is just replacing uh, the information on a save that you already have. So for instance, uh, let's say that um, I'm trying to mod a uh, Skyrim save. Now what I would do is I would go on the Xbox and make a uh, make a um, a Skyrim save on my Xbox that's already there. And what I would do is like pretty much just go in the character creation, make a save, and then once you have just a level one save, you would put it on your flash drive. And how the fuck I have Discord off? Sorry about that. Um, you would already have a Skyrim save on your um, Xbox. And it could be, it doesn't matter, it's just level one, but um, let's say like, so that way we already have a Skyrim save. What we would do is we would take that level one character, um, and then we can go to uh, the contents, and we have this uh, saved out of right here. And I want to make sure this is Skyrim. All right. So then what we do is we would go to the contents of that save once we dragged it in from the USB, uh, assuming your USB is already plugged in, and we can uh, right-click that and hit replace. And then we would replace it with the modded Skyrim save that's right here. And I guess I didn't do anything because of exactly. Oh, Horizon is being a bitch. Okay. And so, well, this is this would happen as well, just not with Skyrim or Horizon not responding. And then once you do that, uh, make sure to. Uh, hash and or save and rehash and that would, that would be it um another another tip just uh just in case uh you guys do it um a different way is uh if you ever have um a game save that's on your your desktop not already on your usb but if it's just on your computer and you just drag it in from your uh desktop and it's not already on your usb um, after you edit the save, if you do edit it, uh, you would hit rehash and resign, and then save to device. Do not save the device before rehashing and resigning. And I'll tell you why. Reha uh, when you save, rehash, and resign, that is just, uh, pretty much saving the information that you edited on the game save to the game save, uh, itself. And then after, so pretty much after you edit it uh, and then save it, then you would want to save it to the uh, your USB device, and it's safer that way. So method two of how to use a, a modded game save is um so let's say you uh, you download some random uh, game save as well, and you're trying to mod uh, Skyrim again, or uh, it will work for like any other any other game. Uh, so you download some random game save and you want to actually use it. Um, and you, you don't already have this, uh, let's say that you don't already have this game data on your, um, on your Xbox. What you would do is, uh, you would actually drag, um, drag that modded save into, uh, into Horizon real quick. And then once it's in Horizon... Um, you would go to your USB and you want any game that's already from your Xbox. It can be from any game. Uh, it doesn't really matter. The only thing that really does matter is that this game save is already from your Xbox. 
The reason being is because you need your console uh, and your device and your profile ID from this uh, game save. So I'm just going to choose a random save that's from my Xbox. Uh, so my, let's say like the legitimate random save that you have from your Xbox is on the right hand side right here. And then the modded save that you downloaded from some shitty website is right here. Uh, what you would do is you would take your game save over here and you would copy all the profile, device, and console ID all to the modded game save. So you would copy the profile ID and I do this a lot is control C, go to the modded save and then you would hit control V for copy or for paste and you would do that both for the device and console ID as well. And then once you have that, you would actually save uh, and rehash and resign first. And then once you've done that, you would also save to the device and that modded save would, um, would work for the game. And that's the method you would use if um, you didn't already have that, uh, that kind of save data. Let's like, it would be like a brand new game. You don't even have save data for it. You could just, um, you could just uh, put your information on it first. And uh, just a quick shout out um, to featured videos of mine uh, because this this video is going to come in useful in the future. I'm going to be doing some show show. I want to be doing some showcases uh, of random modded game saves for different types of games and um, uh, all sorts actually. I want to be doing uh, Borderlands. I want to be doing uh, Diablo three. It's going to be it's going to be good. So if you guys are um, if you guys watch this far, if you're looking forward to that, subscribe to my channel because I do a lot of I do a lot of modded content. I do a lot of gaming content. I also make music as well on top of it. So. I'll see you guys in the next one, and comment down below if this was useful, and peace. There once was a guy created something special. He worked so hard. Uh-uh. He found a way to get us to the inside.